Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a, whoop, this, with a 5x5 five five checkerboard pattern. Trust me, it's much easier than a 4x4 four four checker pattern, well, in my opinion. Let me just show you how to make it. And put it back to get together in its normal, in its normal state if you don't like it. So yeah, first of all, we get our, we get our 5x5 five five right here. I also have a 4x4. Four you can see uh, a 3x3 three three that's accidentally scrambled. I'm not a cuber. I'm learning, I've already learned how to solve a 2x2, two two, but that's for another video. Anyways, let's see. Um, we got this. So we're going to mainly focus on this line and this line. So these two lines I'm touching. So first of all, um, get this. Turn it two times. This. And this two times. Then we go the opposite way. It's hard to shoot. This two times. This two times. This two times. This two times. You might think I'm done, but I still have all this to go. So let's get a random side, not this side. I'm warning you here. So this side, this side, this side, this side, or this side. Anyway, so just get it uh we do the exact same thing turn it once turn it twice turn it once turn it twice and then bam you got it and then if you want to put it back to its solved state go once and then twice again and once and then twice again and we're going to solve this side oops once and then twice again once and once and twice again i'm super scared that i'm going to pop this cube and then obviously you have these stripes, so you can just put them back to their original colors, like this. Hmm. Yeah, it's pretty. It's very easy to do this, especially for non-cubers like me. Finally, I'm done. Anyways, if I hope you, this was a good tutorial. If you like it, you can do whatever you want. Bye.